¿De dónde viene? Por tierra, la anotación, la primera de... Hello, can you hear me? Yeah. Welcome, to welcome to another English class. How are you today, Miss Sabrina? I'm fine, teacher. And you? I'm a little bit tired, but good. How was your day? On Tuesday, teacher. <laughs> yes. Oh, you are young. <laughs> I'm, I'm old. I'm older than you. You are young. You are years, right? How old are you, teacher? If you can tell me. <laughs> yeah, I can. I'm 31. 31? Yes. I'm 33. <laughs> no, 34. <laughs> and you look younger than me. <laughs> the good life. Qué galán, teacher. <laughs> I work since I was 19. Or 18, I think. 18. I didn't have vacation. Mm -hmm. Never. 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 I was Never I just I, I was I was studying in bachillerato mm -hmm. and high school. high school in two weeks, two weeks or one week and half, I think. Yes, two weeks and I was working. Ah, cool. So you began very young work. Yes. Yeah, I began very young too. And I have been teacher for seven years. Seven years. But before being a teacher, I worked in call centers, restaurants, everywhere. Really? Yes. But I like it. How long have you been studying here in this academy? And the last year, I think okay. I so, began with you in this academy. I, I, in the beginner one, uh, okay, Desde, since that, and since I, beginner since, one, yes, nice, cool. And so, I remember that I was studying, I was, of course, just one module. How mm -hmm. do you say module? Module, <laughs> module, module. Mm -hmm. Just one, just one, and I remember that I tell her to my boss, and I tell him, I'm studying English. Okay, well, that's good. Well, él me firmó, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. okay. But I thought that he was forget it, forget that, and I was just studying one module, and an in North American patient mm -hmm. come to us, came to us, and he say, Hey, she can she can attend to you. Can I help. say what? Nice. Me tiraron al fuego. Ah, nice. So how was it? Because you have good good English. I don't remember, but my boss told me that it was okay. Le logré cobrar. Logré hacer ah. la factura. And he told me, I understand. It's okay. Nice. Good, yeah. So sometimes you have to talk, even even if you don't know properly the language. If you see when they when American come to El Salvador, they have a lot of mistakes when they speak in Spanish, but they don't care. They speak. I say, I say to myself, <laughs> él no habla muy bien en español. Yo no hablo muy bien inglés, así que aquí nos vamos. <laughs> Exactly. That's the attitude. Estamos a mano. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. Cool. Okay. All right. Okay. Hello, Mr. Daniel. Mr. Angel, welcome. Let me see Mr. Osbin. Welcome to... Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome to another English class.
teacher en módulo, módulo, eh, lo escribimos igual. Exacto. How, how do I write? Módulo. Module. Module, with an E. I'm, gonna, I'm going to type it here in the chat. Is it M O D U L E? Model. Exactly. Like novel with an M. Ah, okay. Thank I you, teacher. All right. Anytime. Anytime. Well. How many we are right now? 11. Okay, good number. Welcome to everyone. Let's start another English class. Today, what day is it today? What day is it today? What day is it today? Tuesday. Tuesday? Tuesday? Me está haciendo dudar. <laughs> Tuesday 4th. Tuesday 4th. Uh, October. October. Okay. Yo dije, es, es. O yo me equivoqué. Tuesday 4th. Okay. Tuesday, okay. Tuesday, October 4th. Nice. All right. Good. Okay. Well, welcome to another English class. Okay. Uh, tell me, how was your day? How was your day, Mr. Daniel? How was your day? Tell us a little bit about your day. Today, mm. I'm really busy all day because I, I was uh, early in my office because the traffic has not always. And the Fango is in holiday this week because they are celebrating uh, the Rosario Virgin, Virgin of the Rosario. I don't know, but it's, it's a, every, all this is a party, the carnival, the uh, concert, I don't know what happened in the city, but it was stressful, my day, but in the office, I really do see that sort of way. Uh, only that. Okay, good. Thank you, Mr. Daniel. How about okay. uh, Mr. Osbin? How was your day, Mr. Uh, thank you for asking. Teacher, um, anytime for, for me is is great. It was great, and um, in the in the in my work uh, was great, and my family too is great. Um, my God, my God is beautiful with me. Okay, God is beautiful with you. Ah, yes. I like. It. Okay, I will take that phrase to me. Okay, good. <laughs> excellent. I like it. Okay, how about Mr. Angel? Tell us how was your day? Mm, Wes, well, um, so exhausted because I okay, another yes. form, another form. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, another form of saying exhausted is ambit. Ambit, ambit, okay, that means super tired. Tell okay, me, tell me. because I my in my work is so so hard sometimes because i have a lot of mirroring and um, to me it's complicated because uh now i am working from home and for that reason uh, you work at home you have yes home office. yes i have i i made a home office because for my my left because i broke my butt ah, my... okay okay yeah yeah i i i, I remember you told us Yes, and for that reason, it's very stress on time because I have a meeting with uh, another people and I can see and for the reason it's more complicated because sometimes I need to, I have a um, charge of, is that a cargo day? Okay, I am in charge of? Yes, I am in charge of a, a team. Okay. And for the reason it's complicated because I'm here and they are in the in the in the office. In the office. You're here, yes. okay. And you broke your left or your right left arm, sorry. No, it's I'm sorry, no, it's not my um, uh, it's your leg. Is it your leg or your arm? 
my leg. Okay, leg. All right. So you can walk. You can walk right now. Ah, uh, exactly. Yes, I can walk. Well, I start to. I just last the last week. I start to to walk, but I can walk very well. And for no. that reason, I do you but, use do you use crutches? Crutches. What? Crutches. Crutches. It's something that you put here in the armpit. Ah, okay. New York. Yes, I have. But um, for example, right now, the, how do you say orthopeda in English? Orthoped. The orthoped told me that I need to start to, to walk, but just me. Exactly. Without yes. crutches. Without crutches. Ex okay. Exactly. And for okay. the reason, it's complicated. But yeah. it's lyric exhaustive. Okay, I hope you get better. All right. Thank you. Now we're going to practice the speaking part, and I'm gonna I'm gonna show you I'm gonna show you some questions, some questions in simple past tense. Okay, we need to practice also the simple the simple past tense, and I'm going to. Okay, and I'm going to ask you when was the last time? When was the last time? You cut your hair, you said, I love you. When was the last time you had a toothache, etc.? Okay, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to spin the roulette. Hey, what happened? Ah, okay, let's see. How about, how about, okay, guys, tell me. When was the last time you cut? When was the last time you cut your hair? When was the last time you cut her, your hair? Uh, last, last week. Okay, last week. What? Last week, I, I gone. I have gone. No, I gone to cut my hair. I went. I went. I, I'm sorry. I went to to cut my hair. It's in past. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, you went to cut your hair. Perfect, Mr. Daniel, Achimides, Florian. When was the last time you cut your hair? You cut your hair. <laughs> <laughs> two two weeks ago I could excellent perfect yeah. okay three weeks ago okay. you cut your hair perfect Mr. Ospin when was the last time you cut your hair when was the last time you cut your hair I'm sorry I can't hear you I guess you're you you, you got problem with your microphone okay. yeah sorry I went cut my hair um, three weeks ago. Three weeks ago, nice. Okay. Yes. Okay, next question. Oh, oh, what happened here? Okay. Ah. Look, another question. It says. Rode a horse. Okay. Have you ever ridden a horse? Have you ever? When I was a child teacher, um, one time I remember that I, I rode a horse in a, in a I don't, how do you say hacienda? Okay. In a countryside okay. house, in a farm, in, in a, a farm. Okay. Nice. Good. Okay, next question. All right, Mr. Daniel. Hey, when was the last time you went to dance? When was the last time you went to dance? I last it when I when I was in a in a beach in the Costa del Sol. With okay. my friend. Okay, you <laughs> really dance. Excellent. Good. I like yeah. it. How about, okay. let me see. Uh, Mr. Manuel Antonio, when was the last time you went to dance? In case you like to dance. Oh, sorry. Um, four years ago, my friends, uh, they, they went married. 
Okay. And and I I I I I was dance. I was dance. I dance. You dance. That. Okay. okay. I okay. Dance. The last when your friends got married, you danced. When right? my friend got married. Excellent. Let's dance. Okay. Thank you. Good. How about Mr. Jaime Antonio? When was the last time you went to dance? Oh, um. I want to hear that answer. Okay. <laughs> I went to dance la last time at um, teacher's party. Okay, teacher's party. Yes. In the uh, 22, no, 20, 20 June. Okay, uh, June, June 22nd. 22. Yes. Nice. Okay. How about Miss Sabrina? When was the last time you went to dance? Yes, I I, you I went want to hear, to hear you. <laughs> I went to hear you. <laughs> I try to dance, but I can't dance. My brother say that all the songs I dance the same. All right. It's no problem with me. It's no problem for me when the DJ changed the song. <laughs> okay. Nice. What, what, okay. What, I think it was. Before pandemic, okay. with my friend in a in a graduation, in a graduation of my friend, okay. in my friend okay. graduation. Exactly. Nice. I like it. Okay. Good. Next question. Okay. All right. How about? Uh, let me see. Ah, easy. Last time you ate spaghetti. The last time you ate spaghetti. How about uh, Miss Estela? Mabel, when was the last time you ate spaghetti? This, you can answer this. The last time I ate spaghetti was two, two months ago, one, one week ago. But tell us, Miss Estela. Okay, um, I don't like spaghetti. Ah, okay. Um, you don't like spaghetti? I, she never uh, ate spaghetti. Never. <laughs> she has never eaten. No, spaghetti. yes, I I I eat um, sometimes, but I uh, it's not regularly. But the last time uh, I ate spaghetti was since uh, three months ago, maybe. I'm sorry? I don't three remember. Weeks. <laughs> three weeks ago. Okay, good, Mister. Uh, let me see. Mr. Manuel, when was the last time you you ate spaghetti? Oh, uh, my ma my mom liked it, uh, cook spaghetti, um, and two years and two weeks ago I visited uh, my mom. My mom cooked spaghetti and it's a delicious spaghetti. I ate I, I ate delicious spaghetti in two weeks ago. Okay, so you your mom cooked. Spaghetti two weeks ago, and you went to visit her. Okay, nice. Okay. Excellent. Thank you, Mr. Manuel. Okay, next question says Okay, have toothcake. Do you know what toothcake is? Toothcake. Do you know what toothcake is? Dolor de diente. Dolor de diente. Yeah. Exactly. When you go to the dentist, okay, because you have a toothache. I remember the last time I had a toothache was like 15 years ago. I was younger and I went to the dentist. I didn't want to go to the dentist because I was terrified, I was scared. But I finally, eventually I went. How about Mr. Angel? When was the last time you had toothache? Toothcake. Uh, your microphone, Mister. Oh well, as I am remember, uh -huh. I was remember. Sorry, um, I had a toothache when I was at uh, ten years old, I think. When you was ten years old. Yes, when I okay, was. That means seventeen years ago, right? Yes. Nice. Okay, and you were. 10 years old, nice. Good. 
Eh, Mi Sabrina, you, da, you work in a dentist, dentist clinic, right? Yes. So when was the last time you had a toothache? Toothache when I was 13 years old. Okay. When I was, and while I'm working in the clinic, I have not have toothache because uh, it's, is necessary the control when I work. Okay, good. They, they, they do our cleaning, our filling, our control, but nice. para nosotros, para que estemos bien. <laughs> cool, I like it, good, okay. Let's see, next question. Okay, we're gonna have two questions, two questions. Okay, and let me see. I like this question. When was the last time you said, I love you? Okay. When was the last time you said, I love you? Miss Estela, tell us, when was the last time you said, I love you? Maybe in the morning when I, um, uh, des despido? I'm sorry, I don't when remember the word. Goodbye. When you say goodbye. I, when I said goodbye to my daughter uh, in the school. Ah, oh, okay, I like it. Thank you, Mrs. Stella, for sharing with us those beautiful moments. Okay, how about, let me see, uh, Mr. Osbin, when was the last time you went, you said, I love you? Just now. Um, now. My daughter. Okay, right now you said it. Just now. Okay, good. Thank you, Mr. How about Mr. Jaime? Last time you said I love you. Oh, sorry, I turned on the camera. Um, I say I love you a few minutes minutes ago uh, to my daughter. Ah, your daughter. Yes. Nice. I say I love. <laughs> okay, love you. Nice. Eh, Ahorita le acaba de decir para yes. decir. No, no, yeah. Solo para I, decir que sí. I talk, I talk, I talk the, uh, with her uh, at 20 minutes ago I'm already. I'm not, I don't know. Okay, good. Thank you. Mr. Okay. Daniel, last time you said I love you. The last time you went to the beach, right? <laughs> uh, no, today when I, in a WhatsApp group, when I'm a friend, I say I love you, everybody, because they they are my close friends. I say you're, you're close <laughs> every friend. simple. Yeah, my close friends. Okay, friend. nice. I like it. Good. All right. And the last question. The last question says. Let's see. Okay, last time you visited a friend. Mr. Manuel, tell us, Mr. Manuel, when was the last, last time you visited a friend? Uh, and today, in the afternoon, I visited my friend in her house. Okay, good. You went to her house. Like it. And Mr. Angel? Um, well, I visited um, my friend like four months ago. Four months ago. Nice. Yes, because uh, during this time, my friends come here. <laughs> okay. They came to visit you, right? Yes. All right. Me, Sabrina, last time you, visit, you visited your best friend. This is my best friend. Um, um, I think three weeks ago. Three weeks ago. I visited, yes. All right, nice. Good, okay, thank you. All right, so uh, thank you very much for your participation. I hope you like it because this was an speaking activity. And the purpose of this activity was that you speak in English in the past tense. So, hope you like it. Uh, next, 
later, eventually we're gonna have another speaking activity, but right now we need to reinforce, okay, the information you wrote yesterday. You remember yesterday you wrote a 10 line paragraph about the advantages and disadvantages of implementing a focus group to test a product, okay? But I'm gonna share this, I'm gonna share a screen. Okay, here it is, here it is the, the info. All right, and also last time we had this conversation, this conversation, this conversation set. Have you made any progress, any progress with this sample selection for folk, for the focus groups? Sure, Moises. We will have three groups of at least twenty four participants to collect accurate results. Will we work with target or random samples? In addition, we need to discuss who will be monitoring each group and the location for each. You're right, because we want to find out the overall perception of the product, we will go for a random sample. Furthermore, it's necessary to create a well-designed questionnaire to get the specific information we require. I'll meet Lucas today in the afternoon, so we work on it. Let's start. Uh, I don't know if you would like, or do you want me to repeat any word or the pronunciation or the meaning? Is there any doubt? Is there okay. If we don't have doubt, we can uh, we can practice. I need to volunteer. I need two volunteers. Okay, I'm here. You want? Okay, Mr. Luis, thank you. Thank you very much. Me. Um, I can do it. And I'm sorry? I can do it, but I don't know if okay. I. Okay, yeah, you can, be, you can be Fernanda. Okay, Mr. Luis, he will be Moises, and you means you can be Fernanda. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Okay. Three, two, one, action. Okay. Um, have you made any progress with the sample selection for the focus group? Sure, Moises. We will have three groups of uh, at least 24 participants to collect accurate results. We will work with target or random sample. In addition, we need to discuss who will be monitoring each group and the location of each. You are right, because we want to find out to our perception of the product. We will go for a random sample. sample. But furthermore, it's necessary to create a well-designed questionnaire to get the specific information we require. I'll meet Lucas today in the afternoon so we work on it. Nice, I like it. Good pronunciation, good intonation. Okay, good. Uh, how about Mr. Manuel? Can you be Moises, Mr. Manuel? Okay. And Mr. Jaime, can you be Fernandez? Yes, teacher. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, action. Have you made, have you made any progress with the sample selection for the focus group? Sure, Moises. We will have three groups of at least 24 participants to collect accurate results. We will work with target on random samples. In addition, we need to, to discuss who will, be who will be monitoring each group and the location of each. You're right, because we want to find out the over our perception of the product we will go to, we will go for a random samples. Furthermore, it's necessary to create a well-designed questionnaire to get the specific information we, we, we require. I meet, I meet Lucas today in the afternoon. So we work on... 
So we work on it. Thank you. Okay, we're going to reinforce the pronunciation of furthermore. 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 Okay. Furthermore. Uh, accurate. 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 Excellent. At least. At least. Perfect. At least. Good. At least. All right. Thank you very much for your participation. Now I will take the tender list. So please get ready. The same rules. When you listen to your knee, okay, say hi. I'm sorry, say present or presente or here as you as you feel comfortable. Okay. So like I said at the beginning, today it is uh, Tuesday 4th. Okay, so here I am. Here I'm gonna start. Okay, Angel Antonio Benavides Ventura. Benítez Ventura, presente. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, sorry. The thing is that this list is too tiny in the word and it's for me difficult to read it, but I'm so sorry, mister. I'm apologizing. Don't worry. Marroquín Martínez. Marroquín Martínez. Present teacher. Thank you, miss. Present. Eh, Lucas Pérez. Present. Thank you, Mr. Florentino Garcia. Present teacher. Thank you, Mr. Álvarez Mejía. Álvarez Mejía. All right. Miranda Rodríguez. Present. Abelar Cortés. Present. Thank you. Eh, Valdés Gómez. Valdés Gómez. Aguirre Chavarría. Present. Merino González. Present. Ramírez Arevalo. Present. You, eh, Cuellar de Barrientos. Cuellar de Barrientos. Ventura de Valdés. Ventura de Valdés. Galicia Gertrudis. Present. Thank you, All right. Eh, let me see. Okay. Escamilla Jurado. Present, teacher. Thank you, mister. Um, Mancilla Gutierrez. Uh, pre present, teacher. Thank you, mister. Cornejo Erazo. Present, teacher. Thank you, Vasquez Romero. Vasquez Romero. Flores Hernández. Present teacher. Thank you, Mr. Osbin. Garcia Orellana. Present. Thank you. Vasquez Vasquez. Vasquez Vasquez. Gómez García. Present teacher. Thank you, Orellana del Cid. Present teacher. Cool. All right. Thank you. Well, uh, last time, yesterday, you had to write the paragraph, the paragraph about the advantages, the advantages and disadvantages of uh, having a focus testing. All right. It was this activity, number five. So I don't know if you already finished, if you finished this activity. Okay, well, I'm going to give you two minutes. Is it okay, two minutes? To give the last details, two minutes. Is it okay? Yes. All right, okay, so we're gonna start in two minutes, right?
If you're ready, let me know, please. Okay. Is there any volunteer to read the paragraph? Me, teacher. Mister, thank you for being volunteer. Read it, okay, read it. Okay. Uh, some advantages I think is easily measure custom reaction. Um, furthermore, the focus group is good because allowed researcher to look beyond the fact that might be obtained for the methodology. methodology. In, furthermore, it's expensive to, uh, to execute that. In addition, it's necessary to compare surveys and questionnaire um, because we can get a better result. Uh, we can get amazing result because we have a bar variety of opinion. In addition, that kind of opinion is very important for all the process to launch the new product. Just that teacher. Just that? Okay, I like it. I like where it was very concise. You include an addition, furthermore, okay, transition words, nice. Also, you use vocabulary that we have been studying during the previous class. Excellent. All right, I don't know if we got another volunteer. Another volunteer. Another volunteer to read the paragraph. Okay, thank you, Miss Sabrina. Okay, disadvantage. Uh, one of the disadvantages, it can be not enough opinions. Okay. Furthermore, it's necessary to select carefully the focus group. One of the advantages, are different opinions. In addition, different point of view that can help us to improve the product. And we save time. Moreover, we give attention to the focus group. Okay, excellent, I like it a lot. Okay, good grammar. Okay, uh, you use transition words, with good vocabulary. Excellent, okay. Thank you, Miss. All right, another volunteer. Daniel has the activity for make for May yesterday. <laughs> yes, with lady, lady was in this group. Alexander. Okay, Miss 
Yeah, teacher, I, I read it. Okay, go ahead, mister. Okay, I just try. A focal group is an useful method that can be used to quench those customer reaction to promotional products, for example, for the more, for example, for example, okay. For the more, when if, when if it were an individual interview and as well, will not be as efficient to you know in the product, it will be profitable. That is why it's necessary to work with a group of people. In addition, the use in the group if the result show more complete information and with different variables, obtain more that and specification. That's all. That's all? Okay. Good. Thank you, mister. All right. Okay. Excellent. Good job. All right. Well, uh, now I see we don't have, or do we have any another volunteer? Do we have another volunteer? No? Okay. So uh, now, uh, here we're gonna have, okay, here we're gonna have this. Okay, so it says, we're going to go over the vocabulary and it says target sample, random sample, competitive threat, and all right, on, right, unbiased, unbiased, all right. So uh, the thing that we're going to do right now, first of all, we're going to uh, we're going to investigate the, okay, the meaning, okay, the explanation of these words, right? It says here, go online to find out more about key terms related to the pro product testing. Okay. But first of all, we're going to do this. We're going to look for the explanation of these words, okay? How would you explain this word? Okay, competitive threat, random sample, target sample and okay when you find the 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 meaning you have to write one sentence for each one sentence for each okay you have to write us one sentence for each okay uh, i'm going to make we're going to make group of four we're going to work on this activity you can find this vocabulary investigate the meaning and create sentences using one uh, work, for example, target sample, random sample, competitive threat, and all right, the last one. Here we go.
it, teacher, I have a question. Uh, no, what, what is the meaning of ein? I'm sorry? What is the meaning of ein or a? Uh, the letter uh, a, I, M. Uh, help? Is a synonym of help? Ah, okay. Thank you. Did you find something re related? Oh, well, I was investigating about the target sample and say that it's like, um, which is taking with the aim of detecting a illegal treatment or a not, a com not compliance. Okay, aim. Can you type it here in the chat? Okay. That's where. Ah, yeah, aim, help. Okay. And also, let me see. I'm going to look for it. Okay. Ah, uh, it is. Let me see. Okay, it has many, many, many definitions. For example, it says have the intention of achieving point of or direct. Okay. Que está ligado, puede ser traducido también. Está ligado, está dirigido, el propósito, la intención. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, so also uh, the objective, let me see another synonym, the objective, um, the purpose, okay, those are synonyms. Those are synonyms. Um, uh, about aim. Uh -huh. for, uh -huh. for, for, for la nueva temporada. Sounds sound good. What do you think about this supposed to be? The idea is to say. Or to be, what, what do you think about this sound, the question sample? Teacher, <laughs> can you tell us an example with the first? <laughs> we don't understand <laughs> the activity <laughs> to uh, make sentences. <laughs> yeah, first of all, you need, you need to look for the definition or the explanation of each word. Tiene que buscar el significado o cómo se emplea la palabra. But and after we have to make a sentence or and only then, the meeting? Then first of all, only. the meeting, because you are in group. The meeting, and then you have to make the sentence using target sample. Uh, okay. Unbiased. Okay, but for, for the first target sample, I think this example. This week, Night Factory have target sample for the new client. And what is the meaning of target sample?
the example, for yeah. example, is if you, you, and let me see. For Come example, on. you make a, a new design in this case, a, 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 for example, example a, a close sample. Uh, you made a new style for uh, the future system. For example, if we made a new design for uh, a, a for spring, for example, is es una muestra dirigida para el, el verano, para el invierno, para lo que sea. Exactly. Uh, is, is the idea. That's okay, the idea. Yeah, I got it. I got it. Exactly. It's like it's something that is for a certain kind of population. Yes, it's true. For example, it's for, for make a, uh, I don't know, pruebas? Exactly. For, for because the, the, in this case, I don't know, the material, I, I had a good tratamen or, I don't know, I don't know in English, but que tengo un buen tratamiento. Exactly, okay, treatment, treatment. Okay. okay, exactly. So, yeah, exactly. Target, target temple. And so, what will be the first <laughs> sentence, <laughs> Daniel or, or Osvin? In this moment, I don't understand. <laughs> Todavía. <laughs> Me confundí. <laughs> Okay, how can I explain this? Daniel, write the first, please. And maybe. I need to be clear about the idea, but I, for me, it's a little confused. Mm, I think we need more explanation to be clear. Because I try, try to understand, but I know. <laughs> I think the other place may is the same problem. Huh? Huh? Okay. Um, I can hear you. <laughs> I have understood you. <laughs> Creo que estamos divagando ahorita. Okay, target temple. Okay, can I explain in Spanish? Yes. Please. All right, target, target sample es como una muestra que únicamente va dirigido para una, para una pop, population, un grupo de personas, ok, eh, antes de poder ser eh, producido masivamente. Con esta target Sample, lo que necesitan es que no exista ninguna, por ejemplo, algún efecto secundario, como decía Mr. Dan, sobre algún producto de la farm farmaciología. Okay. Por ejemplo, una prueba de estudio, pero una únicamente dirigido para una, un grupo de personas muy reducido. Ok. Un, un, una prueba oficial la cual es tomada para eh, detectar okay, eh, alguna, algún efecto que antes de ser eh, producida masivamente target sample Okay, yeah. I can use, for example, yeah. mini, Ministry of Health in El Salvador uh, is make a target sample mm -hmm. for the new medicine. Medicine, exactly. For, for the new COVID-19 medicine. Exactly. Good example. Oh, okay. Like, for like example, the, like when the, they, they like create the vaccine. Uh, when exactly when they create the vaccine, we were the target, the target sample. Thing of COVID-19. 
exactly. For, well, for, uh, exa for example, exactly. for example, uh, aspirin for children. An aspirin, okay. Yes, is is target sampler for children only. I don't know. Okay, and I don't know if if there is another question with the uh, another another the other words like random sample. Random sample um, is aspirin for uh, adult. Randoms, random. Random. Eh, eh, random. It is aleatorio. Aleatorio. Yes. Entonces es un es un por ejemplo, la versión original de un, de un producto que lo van a, a revisar. Por ejemplo, una población aleatoriamente. En la otra va dirigido a un grupo de personas específico, pero en el random sample es que usted toma 100 personas al azar y hace la prueba. Ok. Es eh, cuestionar es como cuestionario? Mm, puede ser un cuestionario, puede ser que usted le diga, pruebe este platillo y nos dice qué piensa. La prueba puede ser de diferente forma. Ok. Pero esto mismo que estamos hablando sería el ejemplo de la oración. Y ahorita estoy dando como un, un como una forma para explicarle lo que significa random sample. Hey, the teacher, the teacher is, is explaining the, the terms. Mm -hmm. La del random sample, it is when you take, you take randomly people to test a product. Okay, uh, random sample, I take uh, 10, 10 person um, and say uh, the, the 10 person you drink um, acetaminophen liquid. Okay, but uh, how yeah. about another kind of product? It can be a new dish, no platillo, a new, oh, okay. a new, pair, a new sneakers, no tennis, okay. Okay. Right, can be a peel, una pastilla. Okay. Yeah, I say, I say the um, ten person uh, you drink a uh, new beer. Exactly, a new beer. And you, you say me is God, is is God right. or, or is bad or okay. you like it. Exactly. A random sample. Good. Okay. Ahí estamos. 
<risa> that, que la... ¿Cuántos años ¿Eh? tienes, Fabri? Me, 24, yes. 24. 24. He's very young. <laughs> And you? Yes, you look, I, you look very young. I pass in the in this year. Ooh. <laughs> How? More than 40? No, verdad? No, no. More than 40? No. Sorry? Four? More than 40? Más de 40? No, verdad? No, no tiene más no. de 40. No. no. Usted no? Entonces viene y me dijo, mira, me dijo, ¿Me voy a ir a comprar ¿Mabel? 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 Ah, ¿Mabel? Los dos no pueden I am 45. <risa> <risa> I am 45. Yes. <risa> okay, I, I am 38. 38. Ah, I know you're young. <risa> 38. Yes, you look young. For 40. We are younger. We are younger. Younger yes, than you. How old are you, Sabrina? 24? 24. 24. Yes, so very young. 24. <laughs> yes. Very young. Okay. okay. Very young, yes. Okay. Um, teacher. We are deciding, teacher. We are deciding. I need, I need, uh, <laughs> <laughs> the teacher is a living book. Teacher, es que we are on this, the first model. And when we are together, we talk, we talk, we talk. Nice, yeah, that's the purpose. I'm sorry. It's my, my, no, enemy. I... It's my enemy and I, my best friend. <laughs> we are enemies on the side, until the model. We have a relation fight. En love. <risa> Así dice mi amiga. Relación de amor, obvio, dice cuando se caen mal, pero se caen bien. Solo <risa> Okay. So, and why do you fight usually? Because <risa> bueno. always we were in first place, really, Jaime. <risa> yes. ¿Verdad? When, yes. when we want to participate in the class. <risa> And when we got a second play, and I, when I, we I played the, <laughs> when we played in the in the class, we, like a kahoot, like a, um, the already plays. <laughs> or always, or always we have the same dog, or the same sentence, or the same explanation, the same answer, verdad? ¿Verdad que sí? Yes, yes. <laughs> Confirmo. <laughs> ok, eh, teacher, I, um, se lo voy a decir en español. Tenemos, chan, chan, chan. <laughs> tenemos bueno, yo, yo tengo una duda, pero no sé. Yeah. En um, el target, tar, target sample, mm -hmm. um, I understand it's like a um, algo test. Or when we have a, uh, or when we to a. Um, That is random or no, target. target, target. Mm, okay, target es como, es una prueba original de algún producto, un prototipo original de un, ah. de un producto que, que va dirigido para un grupo de personas específico eh, para ver qué reacciones tienen cuáles son la, los comentarios del producto antes de poder producirlos eh, masivamente. Mm, okay. El random, random sample es como una prueba que usted realiza a un grupo, pero de forma aleatoria. Dice, ah, voy a escoger estas personas aleatoriamente. Y usted hace la prueba. En cambio, la otra es, es dirigida. Ajá, lo que, lo que pasa es que lo habíamos, bueno, yo lo había entendido de esa manera, que era como, si voy a aplicar a un nuevo trabajo, me piden todos los exámenes médicos, es como algo dirigido. Este, porque también, por algo que decía acá, eh, the official, means official sample, dice, with is a take, taken, with the aim or detecting an illegal tra treatment. Mm -hmm. Or a non -com complaint. I'm sorry, no, I don't see it well. 
Eh, dice non complaints with the maximum residuals limit or maximum levels. Ajá, pero dice que era como la pero que estaba como legalmente aprobado por la industria farmacéutica o algo así. I don't know. <laughs> sí, sí, es como eh, como puedo O sería como para la tolerancia de ciertos productos en... Exacto, para ver si no producen como un efecto secundario. Ah, ok. Por ejemplo, eh, digamos, usted dice, agarra una población, una muestra de población, pero va dirigida, ¿verdad? Va, va a escoger a 100 personas que están enfermas, por ejemplo. Entonces, no, no lo va a producir de una vez. Entonces, Ah, tipo... va a... Tipo la, la vacuna contra el coronavirus. Exacto, pues es como 100 personas y ve qué, qué efectos produce este producto. Pero va dirigida para personas enfermas, por ejemplo. En cambio, en la otra aleatoria es que usted escoge las personas Algo masivo. antes de ser masivo, antes de ser masivo. Por El ejemplo, random, el random es es como aleatorio. aleatorio. Ajá, en esas personas que usted va a escoger, puede decir, no es que la característica en común no va a ser que están enfermos. Pueden ser que unos sean viejos, unos que sean altos, unos bajos. Las razas van a ser diferentes, eh, las preferencias, los hábitos, los alimenticios, todo va a ser aleatorio. En cambio, en la otra va a ser como más específico. Target. Por ejemplo, si usted tiene un producto nuevo, un nuevo platillo, ¿a quién va el eh, ¿Quién le puede dar, quién le puede dar eh, mejor eh, feedback? ¿Una persona que usualmente compra comida rápida o alguien que hace, que prepara su comida? Pues quien le va a dar mejor eh, comentario va a ser la persona que usualmente compra. Ese ya es target porque va dirigido. En cambio en la random, usted está pre preparando un platillo y esa la, la población va a ser Todo, cualquier tipo de persona, los que compran, los que no compran, los que hacen ejercicio, los que preparan su comida, todos. Esa random también podría ser como los que se ponen a dar muestras gratis en los supermercados de producto nuevo. Así es. Eso Así sería es. random. La... Exacto. Así es. Ah, ok. Entonces la otra no va a salir. <ríe> But in the first, in the first, we say, uh, in the sentence, uh, we write, it, we wrote, I need to do the target sample for the competition. It's okay. For the competition. What competition? Ah, tenemos que poner. This is the problem. We, we think uh, we have um, another uh, definition. Definition. Yes, I'm sorry. <laughs> But now I know, we know, we know about it. All right, thank you. But I need to Thank close you. the breakup rooms. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, no, I said que dura mucho los breakup rooms. We didn't finish. <laughs> okay, guys, hello again. Okay, we were discussing with some groups the sentences. I know it's quite difficult. to find the equivalent of this vocabulary, of these vocabulary. Okay, um, but well, all right. So I don't know if we got volunteers. Okay, with the tar target sample. <clears throat> okay. Tell me. Who is the volunteer? All right. <laughs> Tell us, Mr. Lewis. Ah, okay. I am the volunteer, right? Yes, sir. Okay. Um, I think uh, in, I was discussing with the group in target sample, but about target sample. And um, we have um, an idea about that. Uh, maybe about the target sample uh, is, um, or it can be, uh, um uh, different situations uh where we have to choose what is the main target uh 
that we want to, to impact. Maybe when you are uh, launching a new product or maybe uh, when you are, where you are comparing uh, two or more products in the market, uh, you have to choose uh, what, what kind of client uh, you want to, to, to uh, introduce in your scope exactly. in the market. Exactly. Excellent. Thank you, Mr. Luis. So target sample, okay, is when we want to know people's opinions, right? Okay, according to what you said. Thank you, mister. Good. Okay, how about random sample? Random sample. Okay. Sure. Tell me, mister. Tell me, tell me. Oh, well, I... I know about random sample investigate. I think is the random sample is when you have um you want to launch a new product, but mm -hmm. you have a, a different product, but you know that the all the product will be impactful of to the customer, but the people select uh, one of um, all the the sample, for example, hmm. um, it's like, a, how do you say, aleatorio? Exactly, random. Ah, yeah. Random. And that, aleatorio uh, is random or random. Uh -huh. uh, for example, you have a, a, a different uh, sample, but mm -hmm. the people select whatever one, but the, all the, the, the product is good, or mm -hmm. maybe all the product is... Um, impact in the customer. For example, like a, a select a choose when you go to a, to, to buy a, a, a choose, have a different brand, mm -hmm. but all the brand are impacting, maybe I think, but you have a, you select the, the most, um, in the most, I don't know how do you say that, but you select uh, whatever. For example, you don't have a, a, a specific, a, uh -huh, a specific brand, but you select one. But you know that all the product have a a very a nice product. I think. Okay, good. Okay, so random is when you take it uh, randomly, right? Uh, you don't specify. Okay, you take the audience, okay, in, let me see. You took every kind of people or every kind of uh, product, right? That's what you tried to explain. Okay, random. Okay, so a target sample, okay, I'm going to explain this in Spanish. Okay, el sample target es cuando se va dirigido a una prueba, pero va dirigido a un grupo de personas específicas. Okay, para hacer antes de, de ir a su producción masiva. Y el random sample es cuando se toma, eh, se va a realizar un, una prueba de un producto, pero este, esta prueba va eh, de una forma aleatoria. Okay, no hay ningún patrón en común, únicamente que tomen la prueba para que digan, o oh, realizar las pruebas del producto para que digan eh, su opinión. Okay, how about competitive threat? Competitive threat. Competitive threat. Competitive threat. Competitive threat. Um, okay, I think uh, the term is, is about uh, when in the, in the same place, mm -hmm. can be in the same, in the same market. Mm -hmm. uh, we have different products, but uh, the characteristics are similar in the product, in different products, and 
you can uh, face different situations to to put your brand in the market or, or to main, um, uh, keep your brand in the market you have to face different situations because the products what are in the market um, can be similar uh, to okay. your product okay exactly it's like your competitive right like coca-cola against a Pepsi, ok, algunas amenazas de mercado, podemos decir, algunas amenazas competitivas. Es cuando el rival directo de nosotros, de nuestra, nuestro producto, eh, presenta nuevas mejoras, ok. Offers. Offers, exactly, sales. Entonces, esos son como a threat competitive. Right. Contenido free. Ok, for example, let's suppose let's suppose uh, Texac, uh, Texac. Uh, Pepsi has a new beverage, a new beverage, una nueva bebida. Okay, so that is another, that is one, a competitive threat, competitive threat. Okay, so, all right, let's continue. Okay, with the, with the election. All right, and let's move on to page um 24 24 24 are you ready read the following excerpt about tips to design focus group questions it says, you can help your members have a more productive session by asking questions that grab their attention and get them to provide more honest and complete responses. Introduction. Begin, begin the session with a set of questions that will, will enable focus group members to get to know each other better. Example their favorite hobbies and interest, 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 what they enjoy, focus groups, etc. Fun starter question for activity. Ask a fun question or do a team building game to get the group's cre uh, creativity following. For example, ask them to think of three words to describe their favorite hobby. Format, when choosing focus group question, be sure to include a mix of multiple choice questions to the provide structure and direction in open-ended question to allow for further exp exploration and discovery. Rating scale, select an appropriate rating scale to measure different levels of approval. To specify, avoid that open-ended question that simple as why. The word why has a negative meaning. It makes the respond think their first answer was not good. Instead, ask res respondents to provide some specific examples of what they liked or did not like about the item in question. Closing. Thank the participant for their help. Ask if there anything could be done to provide their experience as a member of the group, as a focus group. So guys, this is an example how you can create, how you, how you can create a questionnaire, okay, for testing a product. Un questionario para que pueda eh, crear, perdón, es unos tips para crear eh, cuestionarios, para crear, ese cuestionario ayude a eh, testear un producto, ok, testing product, ok, so I want you to read these examples, these tips, ok, we're going to read only, ok, we're going to read only, 
Let me see. Okay, here we go. We're going to read uh, the introduction, fun style question or activity, format, rating skills, specificity, okay? And closing, we're going to read it. We're going to read them from one until number six, okay? From one till number six. Okay, please, we're going to practice the pronunciation, the pronunciation.
teacher. Okay, hello. Hello, hello, can you hear me? Uh, yes. Okay. Teacher, what is the meaning yes, what is sir. the meaning of growl? Uh, atrapar. Okay. Grab. Atrapar la atención. Grab their attention. To okay. catch. To catch the attention. And right. enable. I'm sorry? Uh, what is the meaning of enable? Enable. Can mm -hmm. you spell it? E-M-I, e no, E-M-A-B-L-E. Okay, can you type it in the chat? Okay. That en enable. Mm, okay, it is like when you are able to do something, capaz de, um, what else? Um, habilitar, permitir, hacer posible. Okay. Okay, so here we have the conversation. Uh, can you read, Mr. Jaime, the introduction, please? Yes, teacher. Okay. You can help your member have, you have a more productive season by asking questions that grab their attention and get them to provide more honest and complete responses. Excellent. Introduction. Miss, let me see who is who has the camera on. Uh, Mr. Luis Galicia, can you help us reading the introductions? Yes, no problem. Introductions uh, begin the session with a set of questions that will enable focus group members to get to know each other better, and their favorite hobbies and interests, what they enjoy focus groups, etc. Excellent. Uh, how about Mr. Jose René? Fun starter question or activity? Yes. Can you read it? Can you read it? Oh. Fun starter question or activity. Ask a fun question or do a team building game to get the groups creatively flowing. For example, ask them to think of three word, words to describe their favorite hobby. Excellent. Thank you very much. Format. Mr. Osbin, please. Format. Okay, format. When choosing focus graph question, be sure to include a mix of multiple choice questions to provide structure and direction and open-ended questions to allow for further exploration and discovery. Excellent, thank you. Creating scale. Okay, to number five. Okay, volunteer, Miss Sabrina, can you please? Yes. Specify four, it. four and five. Please. Okay. For rating skill, select an appropriate rating skill to make sure different levels of approval. Continue. Number five. Ay, teacher, esa palabra era la que no quería. ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Especify. Especify. Especify City. Especify City. Excellent. City. Okay. City. As you wish. City or city. Okay. Especify City. Avoid, avoid vague open-ended question that simple ask why. The word why has a negative meaning. It makes the respondent think their first answer was not good. Instead, ask response to provide some specific example of what they liked or did not like 
about the item in question. Okay, good. About item, okay, item. Item. Exactly, and the closing. Miss Estela, the closing, please. I'm sorry, it's me? Please. I didn't listen well. The closing, please. Okay, closing. Closing. Uh, thank, thank the participants for their help and ask, ask if there anything could be done to improve their experience as a member of the focus group. Excellent. Thank you very much for your participation in this reading. Okay, this reading, it shows us how we can make a questionnaire for a testing. Okay, now it's time, it's time you speak. So I brought these questions, okay? We're gonna have some questions in using the present perfect and we need to discuss them with our classmate. With our classmate. These are the questions. Can you see them? Have you, can you see them? Yes, yeah. I can see. Okay, good. So we have the first question says, have you ever met a celebrity? Have you ever ridden a motorcycle? Have you ever fallen in love at first sight? Have you ever been on TV? Have you ever gone mountain climbing? Have you ever told a big lie to someone you love? Okay, we're going to discuss these questions. Okay, try to give your complete answer. Okay, try to give the complete answer. And then, okay, and then you have to, uh, you have to talk, okay? You have to talk. I'm going to choose some of you and then I'm going to choose the question and you have to uh, respond the question. Is it okay? Yes. Good. Uh, this only is only one a, question, teacher. A, yeah, Sorry, can, only one question. You can this. You have to discuss all of them, all of them. Okay. The purpose of this activity is first you speak. Okay. Try to speak. Don't worry with the mistake. Mistakes are part of the process. Second, Good. you use the present perfect. Okay. That is the 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 second. Okay. okay. You use the present perfect. Okay. And third, that you feel comfortable with yourself speaking in English. Okay, now it's time for you to speak. So okay. we're, we're going to discuss. Uh, we're going to discuss. Okay, the question with our classmates. Try to help. If you see your classmate has any doubt, and you know the answer, help them, please. Okay, so I will be here in the different breakup rooms, and if you have any question. Let me know. I'm going to make. Okay, we're going to have, I guess, 10 minutes to discuss the questions. Okay, we're going to discuss the questions. Here we go. The question in present, perfect. Thank you. 
someone can share the team. Share. Cool. To make the question to answer the question. Do you have the questions? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Do you have the questions? Mm -hmm. I, I, I can have, share. We have the question. Okay, if you want, I can I can paste the question here in the chat. Please, thank you, teacher. Anytime. Okay, speak in English. Speak in English. Okay. Well. Okay. 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 Only and maybe no, we can... no read, no read. Only speaking. Only speaking. Okay. I I will say the question to Stella Mabel first. After that, I will say the question. Yeah. After that, you ask me a question to me. Okay. 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 Yes. Okay. Stella, have you ever read a celebrity? I'm sorry, Daniel. I can't hear you. I don't know why. I guess but I guess I, he's having a problem with his microphone, with his internet connection. Can you hear me? Uh, so so. But can you repeat the question, and I'm um, I'm going to try to understand. Okay. Okay. How how I let me see. I will change my microphone. My microphone. Have you ever met a celebrity, Mrs. Stella? Uh, no, I I have not met a, a celebrity already yet. I'm sorry. One more time, Miss. I have. I have. Uh -huh. I I haven't. Okay, I, I haven't. I haven't uh, met, met. Met, exactly, met. Met, met a celebrity jet. Excellent. It's correct? Very good. Yeah, okay. it is. Thank you. Okay, now I... Yes. I have right just yes. one, just one. One time? Yes. One time, okay. You drive motorcycle. You have been. Ah, yeah. I am never riding a motorcycle. Never. 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 <laughs> okay. Uh, in my case, I uh, I used to uh, drive motorcycle a few years ago. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. The next yeah. question. And Jaime, use a motorcycle. Jaime, Jaime said yes. Yes, I, I ride. Ah, I, Jaime, yes. I, I have ride a motorcycle. Very good. Okay. Every day, and the teacher, you, do you have? Every no. day. The teacher, you have a motorcycle. Yeah, <laughs> you drive. I have ride motorcycle for over uh, 10 years. 10 years? Yes, sir. Since 10 years ago? Yeah, I started... Like 10 years ago, I have driven a motorcycle. Yes, very good experience, right? Yeah, I have met different places by motorcycle. Very good. Yes, me too. But not the hospital, teacher. The hospital. The hospital. But not the hospital. I have, I haven't fallen from the motorcycle yet. You, you, you have, you have crashed. Um, Maybe uh, one occasion, maybe never. one time. Never, never, never. <laughs> never. I have okay. been very close. I have yes. been very close, but never. Oh, good. I I don't know if God loves me or the good look that I have. Yes, yeah. very. Yeah. In the very motorcycle, I I never. Right fall down too but I, <laughs> in the I, car i roll over <laughs> Caminando. No. you you're working and, and crashing in, in the street yes. okay that was more that was 
Okay. Yeah. Beautiful. Hotter. Yes. The next one. Uh, the have next you ever one. fallen? Have you ever fallen is, in love at first sight? Is the interesting. We need to to know this, Sabrina. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Sabrina, I have has. We I want to know. Believe? I have never fell in love with nobody. Some, some, sometimes when I was young in a program in a Domingo para Todos. Nice. <laughs> That's fun. <laughs> but See, I was young. <laughs> did you now, win any prize? Did you win any oh? prize? Did you win any any award? Any gift? No, teacher. Ah, sad. <laughs> I, I didn't participate. <laughs> okay. I had a friend who participated in Saba Saba. Oh, tell me. I forgot the, the name of the program. The, the, the newer one that with William Maldonado. I don't know if you remember. Uh, uh, Feliz fin de no, algo así. Sábado gigante. No, right? No. That is another program. <laughs> okay, no. so this afternoon, she went to Williams Maldonado's uh, program. program and she won. In that time, was five five thousand colones. Five thousand. Cinco mil colones. In the oh. Paso. She oh, won. Oh, really? I remember you could. You could go to the supermarket. It was called Hiper Europa. I don't know if you remember. Yes, I remember. Uh, this, this market so, doesn't exist. Exactly. So she bought a lot of things with 5,000 colons. A lot of things. A lot of things. Wow. Yeah. Clothes, food. Uh, she bought things for her mom, for his sister. A lot. In that experience. But I have never... I have never appeared on TV yet. How about Mr. Daniel? Have you ever appeared? No, I <laughs> I never be on TV. Would yes, you like to really. like to appear on TV? I really no. Okay. I don't because I a little bit a little bit is is shin I don't know. Shy. shy. <laughs> yes. You look shy, uh, but. but I, you look shy, but you, I guess you are very uh, talkative. <laughs> you like to talk. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, yes, when I was child, I am a little bit shy, a, a lot oh. shy, but I, I received a class of dance with uh, singing uh, and uh, other arts. Okay, uh, can you for sing? It, I, yes, I, I lost the, the, the shine. It's oh, the shyness. For, for, okay, yes. good. for it, I change. For it, I change my personality. My personality. But it's, I am here. I, okay, I, good. I, yes. Okay, good. Well, I, I, I have to go to another group. Keep practicing, please. Okay, thank you. Are you here? Hi, tell me. I uh, I don't have the the question. I just have the. I remember ah. the just first the two first. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I was with another group. That's why here you have the question in the chat. Ah, okay. Ah. Oh yes. Okay, Mr. Manuel, in the in the chat, have a the third. Have oh. you ever fallen in love and? <laughs> <laughs> in love at first sight <laughs> do you believe in that <laughs> <laughs> sorry <laughs> it's how you from this have you ever fallen in love and at first sight yes <laughs> first sight oh, what? oh my god it's i don't remember but I think so it's, I think so it's, uh, well, I, I have, I have fallen in love mm -hmm. at the first sight, but 
when I I when I was like a thirteen years old, <laughs> I I fallen in love with the the teacher. Uh, when I study eighth grade. And the, grade. the the teacher was younger. Uh, the teacher ha the teacher was um uh, like at twenty five years old. Oh really? Your teacher, your English teacher? <laughs> <laughs> no, is the uh, the social I think, but she was uh -huh. very she was very very beautiful. Uh, yes. I it. <laughs> yes, but I I was a young. Oh, no, yeah. I don't believe in that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and you, Angela, have you ever find have you ever fallen in love at first sight? Angela, are you here? Yes, I'm here and my internet is not working. Okay. Entonces se escucha como robótico. I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't worry. It's not brony. Have you ever fallen in love at first sight? Repeat, please. <laughs> Have you ever have you ever fall, falling in love at first sight? First sight. Si me he enamorado en algún lugar, algo así, entendí, ¿verdad? A primera vista. Oh, <laughs> ah, primera vista, ok. Um, yes. <laughs> Can you tell us a little bit about that oh, experience? Yeah. Well, I think she has a problem. She has problem with her internet. Yes. Uh, I, okay. We continue, Mr. Manuel. The okay, next one. Ha, have, how you ever been on a TV? On oh, TV? Yeah. oh, yes. When I was a child, my my dad, my my dad, right? And the and the TV and the TV show and. Um, Gar garden infantil infant uh, okay. I, yeah i know i know i know jardin infantil <laughs> yeah jardin infantil yeah In yeah one. Uh, <laughs> oh when i was when i was a uh, a shy and i you met tio periquito <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> i met tio periquito yeah and i i am oh, no I, I is 6 years old Oh, I, I I six years old. It's it's interesting. My I I, I remember it's um I sing her I I sing her. You can tell. Uh, you sang. Ah, I, I I sang. I sang. Yeah, I sang. I sang. I I sang a uh, a shy uh, a shy song. Yeah. And you, Andrew? Uh, have you no. ever been on TV? No, I have never been on TV. Oh. I am I am not famous person. Okay, here we are again 
Okay, I hope you, I was with some group discussing a, a, the questions and we found some nice answers. Okay, I like it. All right, the first question. Uh, have you ever met a celebrity? Have you ever met a celebrity? In my case, yes. Yes, yes, in my case, yes. Tell us, Mr. How was the experience? Who was it? Uh, in my case, okay. When I was young, uh, I, I, I was 50 years old. Oh, a lot of years ago. Uh, in, front of, in front of cathedral, uh, Juan, pa Pop, Juan Pablo II and come Pop. to El Salvador. Yeah. Uh, in the, I don't know how do you say, the, uh, el parque is, I don't know, in front of cathedral. Uh, we have a, a meet with a lot of, that. yeah. All right. A lot of, with a lot of people, jungers. Uh, okay. was fun, and really fun, but Juan Pablo II was an uh, important person in the uh, back then in the Catholic time. religion. Yeah, okay, in the Catholic religion. Excellent. Okay, good experience. Good, good, good experience. Nice. Okay, anybody else? Have you ever met celebrity? How about uh, let me um, see, Miss, me? tell me, Mr. Jaime. Okay, um, once upon a time, <laughs> I have met uh, Rolando Melendez. Who is it? I'm sorry. Is very nice. Is very nice. I'm so sorry, but I don't know. Is very nice. Right? He's a person who, who, who is has a, is a, a big actor. Hat. CPTO is a celebrity. Yeah, a celebrity. <laughs> because and, it's a, I don't know. Have you seen so, in El Salvador, so, the, the CPTO is a, a celebrity. Uh, yeah, he's a celebrity. <laughs> yes. But you yes. say Rolando Melendez, teacher. I didn't Pero, know who is. Y casi me linchan en el grupo. I'm so sorry. No, I know the, the, the I people don't know. know. Because, because Sabrina uh, has known uh, Cocolito, right? Cocolito. Okay. Cocolito, I, yes. I have met Cocolito. Too. <laughs> okay, good. Uh, okay. Do you know that Mr. Manuel Antonio, he met uh, Tio Periquito? Do you remember him? Oh, yeah, yeah. When I was yes, a child. Yes, I remember. Oh. Yes. <laughs> So, he went to <laughs> He says that he went to a parking. How was it? Uh, the name? How was it? Jardin Infantil. 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 Yeah. yeah. He sang. Okay. So for me, it's... he's a survivor, right? Yeah. He's a survivor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 It's interesting. We had the opportunity that some of you. One half. Nice. I like it. Okay. And okay. So here we have it says, Have you ever fallen in love at first sight? At first sight. Maybe in the bus, right? Commonly, when we, well, when I used to travel by bus, I did once. I fall in love with someone first sight in the bus. How about you? I volunteer. <laughs> yeah, I volunteer. <laughs> okay. Okay. You have. You have. Okay. Good. Okay. Next. All right. And the last one, because we, we have we have just a couple of minutes. Uh, have you ever been on TV? Have you ever been on TV? Someone? With, with a plan uh, control territorial? Someone? <laughs> I <laughs> must say, I must say, I I am. I, 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 no, I, no. I have been. Yeah. I, I, in, in a radio, I have been. Uh, in a radio patrulla. Okay. <laughs> in a radio patrulla. <laughs> the police truck. Uh, 
the police truck. I um, <laughs> I've been in the newspaper one one time. Really? What do you do? And I I am a, I am work at the alcaldía and I have a escuela de karate. Nice. And um, it's a ¿cómo es el rep reportaje? Okay. A report, new report. New report and I I I, I am um, Sorry, I, ¿cómo se dice? I, um, me entrevistaron. <laughs> you had an interview? An interview? I have an interview, mm -hmm. yes. And take a picture. Okay. How do you feel? How did you feel? Ah, Was it? I feel like a celebrity. <laughs> nice. <laughs> you felt like a celebrity. Like, like, like a cocolito, right? Like cocolito. Yeah. <laughs> Good. All right, thank you very much for your participation. The purpose of this activity is for you to practice your English. It is something very important, even because we are, we're, we are studying a present perfect tense. Okay, we need to use the past participle of verbs when we, when we give a negative answer. Okay, so I hope you like it. Okay, and also because it's very important to practice the speaking part. I'm gonna start taking the attendance list and I'm going to start mentioning your names. Okay, and here we go. Benitez Ventura. Present teacher. Marroquín Martinez. López Pérez. Present. Florent Garcia. Present teacher. Álvarez Mejía. Álvarez Mejía. Miranda Rodríguez. Present. Thank you, Abelar Cortés. Present. Valdez Gomez. Here. Thank no, you. Good evening. Aguirre Chavarria. Present. Perino González. Present. Thank you. Ramírez Arevalo. Present. Cuellar de Barrientos. Present, teacher. Thank you. Ventura de Valdez. Present, teacher. Thank you, Miss Galicia. Gertrudis. I'm here. Thank you, Escamilla. Good night. Good night. Escamilla Jurado. Pres Present teacher. Thank you, Mancilla Gutierrez. Present teacher. Good. Thank you, Cornejo Erazo. Present. Vázquez Romero. Flores Hernández. Flores Hernández. García yes, Marina. Thank you. Present. Vázquez Vázquez. Vázquez Vázquez. Okay. Eh, Gómez García. Present teacher. Orellana del Cid. Present teacher. Okay. Thank you. Ahora, eh, let me see. All right. Eh, today it is the turn of Mr. Manuel Antonio. Okay, the rest, see you next class. God bless you. See you tomorrow. Okay, Good thank night. you. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye, -bye. Okay. Bye. 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 Have a nice night. Thank you too. Have a good night. See you. See ya. Okay, mister. Eh, como usted sabrá, esos son 10 minutos donde tiene eh, derecho a, eh, de una forma individual, poder resolver alguna duda que se tenga o también alguna recomendación que le gustaría darnos, todo sea para abonar a la clase de inglés. Um, for me, it's, it's, nothing, it's nothing recommendation, it's a light your class, and I, I think so is is very motivated. Okay, motivated, excellent. It's very motivated, but sometimes, and I have a problem with, with re receive your class, and when I have a problem, a personal problem, okay. and, and, I, and I, I was two times, 
and don't don't receive don't receive your class. And one time is only listened. To okay. Only listened. I was I was only listened to your class. Okay, you you were listening in the class. I okay. were I yeah yeah I was I was I was listening to your class yeah. Okay, well, uh, yes, Mister. Nope, don't don't worry. Okay, I understand. Sometimes we have problems, personal problems, the job, we have our responsibility. Okay, but thank you for being in the class. Participate. I like because you participate a lot. You help us in the class, and I like it when you participate too. Thank you very much. Okay, and also thank you, teacher. But I I have a problem. Is now is I don't. I don't start to 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 fill out of fill, fill out the the platform. It's ah. I I hope next next weekend and okay. fill out the the, pla the the platform. Okay, got it. No problem. Don't worry. I understand. Okay. So, but remember, we right now we're in the class number ten, if I'm not wrong. So you have ten homeworks that you have to do. Homework assignments. Homework assignment. Exactly, the homework that you have in the platform. Right? Or do okay. you have do you have any problem entering to the platform? No, no, but I I I don't I I don't start I don't start uh, the the opening the, the platform. Okay. Don't worry. Next class or ne when you feel ready, you can take it. Okay. Thank you, teacher. All right, Mister. Uh, do you have any recommendation for our, for the class? Oh no, no, I don't have uh, any recommendation for the class. Okay. And and I hope is is uh, uh, always the. Always your class is, is uh, I don't, espero que siempre sea así de, de movida su clase, pues que, que okay. lo pone a hacer ejercicios a uno de diferentes formas. Okay. Eh, me, me gusta esa parte de, del llenado de, 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 cuando pone así los, que uno llena los verbos, eh, but not, not, nada menos, ayer me perdí, Cuando de repente, como tenía abiertas muchas pantallas, este, no, me, no me fijé en qué momento dijo que había que llenar porque no entendí. Entonces, por eso no lo pude llenar. But, pero siempre okay. a mí me, me gusta esa parte de, de la, por lo menos ahora lo de la ruleta, lo de la ruleta, yeah. me gustó mucho. Eso de que cuando pone que uno llene eh, como exámenes de los verbos, mm -hmm. esa parte a mí me gusta mucho. ¿Cómo se, si, si se pudiera tener la, la dirección de cómo practicar ese tipo de verbos, me gustaría. But um, I always, um, I always, um, in, the, in the morning when I, I break up, no, cuando me despierto. When I wake up. When I wake up, it's I, I always, I... I make I make the lesson for Duolingo. <laughs> Excellent, good. As much as you spend time studying, you will see the difference. Okay. All right, Mister. Thank you very much for your words, for your feedback, and because you like the class, that is a lot for me because I I do my best here in the class and I try to do the classes dynamic with different activities. So I appreciate your words. Okay, because this pays off. Thank you very much, mister, and see you next class, okay? Thank you, teacher. Have a good night. Thank you, you too.